in this video we are going to learn factorization you can see here question already so here what is common here m plus 1 m plus 1 so we can take m plus 1 common and here is what is remaining m so we have to write m plus 2 plus 2 finished this much now look at b number you can see here a minus b a minus b so we can take a minus b common and what is remaining here a so we have to write a here is minus b we have to take with sign minus b now look at c number you can see here here is 3 minus y but here is y minus 3 both are not same like a verb so we cannot take common so to make it same we have to take minus common so we can write here x 3 minus y in the place of minus we have to write on plus here is 2 2 and we can interchange this y minus 3 if minus we have to write plus if plus we have to write on minus y because we are taking common minus from here when you take minus common this minus minus it will be plus if plus then plus and from here minus plus minus minus so we have to change the sign and we have to change the places also okay now you can see these both are same so we can take common 3 minus y and what is remaining here x plus 2 so x plus 2 here we have to take with sign now look at this one here also same first of all we have to change you can see here here is 1 minus a b but here is a b minus 1 this both are not same but we have to make it same so what we have to do we have to interchange this one right on same one minus a b actually before we have to change this sign if minus we have to write plus so if plus what we have to write we have to write minus this b b b same and we have to interchange this one minus a b why because we are taking minus common from here now here is one minus a b here also one minus a b so we can take common one minus a b remaining here is one so one here is minus b so minus b hope you understand this now look at question number e here is uh, x minus 2 here also x minus 2 so we can write x minus 2 you can understand up to here x minus 2 is the common here what is remaining 4x so we have to write here 4x here is plus so plus what is here 3x so 3x now you can see x minus 2 we can write x minus 2 because they are unlike term we cannot subtract but these two are like term 4x plus 3x like term so we can add 4 plus 3 7 so we can write here 7x or we can write 7x x minus 2 now look at this one here also we have to interchange first because you can see here here is m minus n but here is n minus m these two are not same but if you interchange this it become same so we can write here m square m minus n in the place of minus we have to write on plus we have to change the sign so we have to write on in the place of minus plus if plus we have to write minus here is mn so we have to write mn and we can interchange these two places m minus n now you can see here also m minus n m minus n so we can write m minus n here remaining m square so m square plus plus mn so mn now you can see from here again we can take m common when you take m common you can write directly front it is m minus n m minus n when you take took m common here from m square m is common so what is remaining m plus plus m already common here and what is remaining n so n we have to write hope you understand this now uh, look at uh, num next uh, number g here is a b minus b c and here b c minus a b uh, these two are same but uh, places are different so we have to take minus common to make it same then we can take common so a b a b minus b c uh, when you interchange these two in the place of plus we have to write minus if minus we have to write on plus here is b c so b c we have to write and interchange this a b minus b c now here a b minus b c a b minus b c so we can write a b minus b c and here what is remaining a b so a b minus minus b c both are same you can write whole square also or you can leave up to here now question number h 
here is 2m minus 4n and here is 4n minus 2n these two are not same first of all we have to make same and then after that we have to take common so 3m 2m minus 4n in the place of minus we have to write on plus and we can interchange this 6 2m minus 4n now you can see here when you uh, took when you will take common minus from here this minus will be plus and we have to interchange their places now you can see um, here also 2m minus 4n here also 2m minus 4n so we can take common 2m minus 4n what is remaining here 3m so 3m plus 6 plus 6 now here what is the common 2 is common remaining m minus 2n because 2 into m 2m 2 into 2 it will be 4 here what is the common 3 common remaining m plus 2 because 3 into m 3m 3 2 is a 6 now this and this we have to multiply 3 into 2 6 m minus 2n m plus 2 now look at next number 4 you can see here 4a uh, from this to what we have to take common uh, four terms are here so two two term we have to take common from here what is the common a is common remaining m a and a already common here remaining m plus n so n from here what is common b and b we have to take b common remaining m plus n so m plus n now you can see again m plus n m plus n so we can take m plus n common remaining a plus b so a plus b we have to write hope you understand this now look at this one here what is the common from this two term common is y y you can see remaining x plus 3 so y common remaining y is already common what is remaining x x plus plus y common remaining 3 so 3 we have to write plus from this two term 2 and 6 common is 2 remaining x plus 2 into 3 2 3 is a 6 now this one from here what we can take common a b and 4 a you can see here a and a we can take a common remaining b plus 4 a into b a b a into 4 4 a plus from this two term what we can take common 5 and 25 we can take common 5 b plus 5 4 is a 20 this one you can see here m square minus mn so from this two term what we can take common m is m we can take common remaining m minus n m already common remaining n so n plus from this one 4 m minus 4 and 4 and 4 same so we can take common remaining here m minus n minus n now again you can see m minus n m minus n so we can take m minus n common remaining here is m so we have to write m plus 4 plus 4 we have to write now look at next now you can see here in question number e x is square and 5y here what is the common nothing is common we cannot take anything common so change this this one if we will take this so here what we can take common x we can take common then remaining x plus 5 here y common remaining x plus yeah so we can take first and third and second and last first of all we have to arrange this x square plus 5x plus xy plus 5y this written here and 5y at last from this two term we can take common x remaining x plus 5 x into x x square x into 5 5x plus from this two term y y we can take y common remaining x plus 5 so x plus 5 again x plus 5 x plus 5 so we can take x plus 5 common remaining here x x plus y plus y hope you understand this now look at this one from here what we can take common from this two term here a square minus 15 b we cannot take any common if we take first and last we have to decide a common remaining a minus 5 okay so we can take this two first and third then last and second so first of all we have to arrange a square minus 5a plus 3ab minus 15b 15b at last no need to change the sign 
if you will take uh, here and there if at the middle is equal then only we can change otherwise no need to change the sign from this to term what we have to take common remain common is a remaining a minus 5 plus from here you can say 3 and 15 comma is 3 a b and b comma is b remaining 3 already common b also common remaining a so a minus minus 3 into which number it will be 15 definitely 5 3 5 is a 15 b which is already common now you can see here is a minus 5 a minus 5 so we can take a minus 5 common remaining here is a so we have to write a plus 3b plus 3b now next you can see here question number g from this two term we cannot take common if we take first and last what we can take common here again we cannot take common if we take first and last one uh, what we can take common here we can take m common okay let's take minus m plus m n minus n plus one here what we can take common here we can take if first term is negative so take minus okay minus as a common m m m m so m is common what is remaining here now here is nothing then one remaining because minus m into one minus m if here is plus we have to write minus because minus is common so we have to change the sign minus minus it will be plus okay m already common what is remaining n so n we have to write plus and we can write this one one minus n okay here is minus n plus one or one minus n same thing now one minus n one minus n one minus n common remaining what is remaining here minus m plus 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 nothing is here so we can write here one uh, now you can arrange it one minus n and one minus m this negative one back side positive one front side hope you understand this question here is x square and here is 12 y square here we cannot take common so first and uh, third and last and second one we have to take x square minus 2xy plus 6xy minus 12y square from this two term what we have to take common x common remaining x minus 2y 6 and 12 common is 6 x y y square common is y remaining 6 y already common remaining x x minus 6 into which number it will 6 to the 12 from y square y is common so remaining y now you can see x minus 2 y x minus 2 y so we can take x minus 2 y common remaining x so x plus 6 y plus 6 y thanks for watching till last please hit the like button and don't forget to share with your friends sharing is caring so please share with your friends and if you're new on my channel so please uh, subscribe and hit the bell button so you will get the notification of upcoming video thanks for watching